Welcome to Chapter 3 of our story, where the winter solstice has reached its peak. The scene is set at the frozen lake, a place now filled with an electric tension that mirrors the beating of Elena's heart. The moon hangs low, casting a silver glow over the ice, illuminating the faces of the gathered townsfolk. Their expressions are a mix of fear and anticipation, as they stand united by a shared purpose. Join us as we delve into this chapter, exploring the mysteries and emotions that unfold in this chilling setting. Elena stands at the forefront, her long, dark hair whipping around her face in the biting wind. The flickering flames of the lanterns cast eerie shadows across the ice, each whispering secrets of the past. Elena remembers the stories her grandmother told her, tales of a curse that has haunted their town for generations. The frozen lake, once a place of joy, now looms as a battleground for their fears. As Elena surveys the crowd, she feels the weight of their shared history pressing down upon her, urging her to confront the darkness that has plagued them for so long. Beside Elena stands Simon, his hazel eyes sparkling with determination. He has shed his skepticism, embracing the warmth of belief. Margot, with her curly auburn hair and shimmering green eyes, draws strength from the air around her. She has always been the emotional anchor of their group, and tonight, her connection to the spirits feels more potent than ever. As the ritual begins, the trio steps forward, their hearts pounding in unison. The townsfolk's murmurs blend into the howling wind, as Elena raises her voice to call upon the spirits of the lake, invoking the ancient powers that lie dormant beneath the ice. As the ritual unfolds, shadows of betrayal flicker at the edges of their vision. Finn, the enigmatic elder, watches from the periphery, his piercing gray eyes revealing nothing of his true intentions. Elena feels a chill creep up her spine, a whisper of doubt threatening to unravel their unity. The townsfolk's growing mistrust looms like a storm cloud, casting a shadow over their efforts. With each incantation, the ice groans beneath them, a reminder of the sacrifices made in the name of the curse. Elena's voice wavers, but she presses on, fueled by the memory of her missing brother and the hope of bringing the lost children back to their families.